A bill to decriminalize marijuana statewide is under consideration once again at the state capitol, and some law enforcement is not happy about it. 11 Live's Doug Richards explains. Backers of the bill say it makes sense for the state to do what cities like Atlanta and others have done, and that is to make marijuana possession laws less punitive. Backers stress that the bill would not legalize marijuana, would not turn Georgia into Colorado or California or other states that have lifted penalties for marijuana possession, but it would make changes that backers say are overdue. Georgia is really far behind, not just far, far behind from Colorado or California. We're far from behind from many Republican states that treat marijuana better than we do. Under state law, it's now a felony to possess more than an ounce of marijuana. This bill would make it a misdemeanor to possess less than two ounces, and it would decriminalize a half ounce or less, making the offender subject to the equivalent of a traffic ticket of no more than $300. It's a move that makes some Georgia sheriffs very uneasy. Marijuana is a dangerous drug. It is a gateway drug. It is destroying the lives of children all over this country. So the sheriff's position is a firm position in opposition of these, these measures. Georgia has broadened its medical marijuana laws with the help of conservative lawmakers, but broadening marijuana possession laws will get a lot of scrutiny from conservatives before it passes at the legislature. Doug Richards, 11 Alive News. A law firm based in